In the heart of a bustling city, there lived two sisters, Kushi and Riva, each unique, each special, and each carrying a story of their own. Kushi, the elder of the two, was a beacon of positivity, her name meaning happiness in their native tongue. She was the sun that brightened the darkest of days with her infectious laughter and radiant smile. A born leader, she was often the one to take charge, her confidence and determination inspiring those around her. Reva, on the other hand, was the moon, calm and serene, her name meaning a star. She was the quiet one, preferring to express herself through her beautiful sketches and heartfelt poetry. Her sensitivity and introspection were her strengths, allowing her to perceive and understand the world in a way few others could. However, even the brightest sun has its eclipses, and the most serene moon its phases. And so it was with Kushi and Riva. Each sister faced her own set of challenges. For Kushi, it was a prestigious competition she had lost, a failure that shook her confidence to its core. For Riva, it was a rejection of her artwork, a failure that threatened to dim her creative spark. At first, they reacted differently. Kushi, the fiery sun, raged against her failure, her usually radiant face clouded with anger and frustration. Riva, the gentle moon, retreated into her shell, her creative light dimmed by the harsh criticism. But amidst this turmoil, their mother, a wise and learned woman, shared a profound verse from the Bhagavad Gita. You have a right to perform your prescribed duties, but you are not entitled to the fruits of your actions. The sisters pondered over this wisdom. Kushi realized that her anger was not against the failure itself, but against the outcome she had so desperately wanted. She understood that success was not the goal, but the journey, the effort, and the growth that came with it. Reva too found solace in these words. She realized that her art was not about praise or recognition, but about expressing her deepest emotions and thoughts. She understood that rejection was not a measure of her talent, but an opportunity to grow and improve. And thus, failure became their teacher, their guide, their stepping stone to success. It taught them resilience, it led them to self-discovery, and it spurred their growth. In the end, the story of Kushi and Reva is a lesson for all of us. It teaches us that failure is not the end, but the beginning of a journey towards success. It reminds us that the fruits of our actions are not in our control, but our efforts are. It encourages us to embrace failure not as a setback, but as a stepping stone to success. So remember, like Kushi and Riva, let failure be your teacher. Let it guide you. Let it inspire you. Because in the grand scheme of life, failure is not just an event. It's an opportunity for profound self-discovery and growth.